Let's take some slap uh, pull-off exercises. So the first exercise I wanted to show you was... Okay, that's the groove. And basically, what we're doing is we're just using the E, A, and D string. We're not even using the G string yet. So the first pattern there is an open E. So we've got a... We've got a open E, thumbed. Dead note. Open E, thumbed. And then we're going to play the E again. To the G on the third fret, and then we're going to go hammer on with our pinky onto the D on the fifth fret of the A string, and then we're going to pull that and we're going to pull off to the C sharp below. So that's the first movement. And then the next movement is the same, it's the same movement. We're going to move up to the A. On the open E, we're going to hammer onto the A. We're going to hammer the fifth, uh, we're going to hammer the fifth of A, which is the E on the A string, seventh fret. We're going to pop that and pull it off down to the D. Okay, and then we're going to do exactly the same movement from the A string. Oh, actually, but we're going to do two pops there. So let me go through that again. Okay, so all together. the groove. Now you put that to a beat. Alright, let's see how we do with that. That's how it sounds. That's how it sounds up to tempo. Let me slow that right down to you. I'm going to play that at half tempo. it at half tempo. Um, so the main techniques in this, <coughs> as we have seen, is to hammer, hammer, 